Welcome to Salign TV's Unboxing FileMaker 14. I'm John Austin Lamprecht, and in this video I'll be showing the new script step called Get Directory. Get Directory allows you to request a user to choose or create a folder or directory for exports or imports. Right now we're on the contacts layout that shows basic contact information for a specific contact record. Up in the top right I've added a new icon button that allows us to export a report of our contact records that shows the minimum contact information for each contact. Let's go through it right now and talk about each step before actually showing the back end of it. So I click on the button and it opens up an OS dialog. On the Windows it will be a Windows dialog and on the Mac it will be a Mac dialog. And you can specify a specific default file location you want the user to see when they open it. In my script step I specified the desktop and what the user can do is they can choose any folder they want or just stay in the default. So I'm going to hit the select button and just stay within the desktop and that's where my export file will be. So I hit the select button and it exports the file to the desktop. I add in the custom dialog to show a success message when the file is successfully exported and the file location of where it is in case the user forgets. In the case of an error, I show an error dialog. Hit enter to exit the custom dialog and we'll move our file maker down to see our file and here it is called developers. And I'm going to double click on that to open it up. And here's our exported file, our report. So now that we walk through it visually, let's take a look at each script step in detail. So I'll open up the script workspace and here's the script right here called export PDF. The very first script step I have is get directory. And in here you have a few things you can specify. First you can do allow folder creation which allows the user to actually create a new folder for the exported or imported file they want. And then you specify a variable that you want to actually contain that folder information or file path rather. And then you can specify dialog title that can also be a calculation so it adds flexibility there on what you want to actually show. And finally you specify a default location of what you want the user to first see when they get to that dialog and as I said before I chose get desktop path. After that I go to the contact list layout that is the layout that actually is my report. I set a file name with developers and then combine the path I got from the get directory which is the file path up to the folder and then my file name of developers which allows me to specify the file name I want it to be exported as. I then do print setup to turn it into a landscape as you could tell it wasn't portrait so I have to change the page setup and then I do a save records as PDF to that file path variable I set up here. I grab any errors and I go back to my original layout which is the contacts layout. If error does not equal zero I show an error dialog. Otherwise I show success and let the user know the file has been successfully created and that the location where they can find the file. And that's all there is to it. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to Salign TV to view more videos from the Unboxing FileMaker 14 series.